guys, it's Cindy and welcome to this video. Thank you for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Now we are in Roblox Horse Life, but we're on my iPad. But you might be wondering, Sandy, why on earth are you on iPad? You play on the PC. I wanted to see how difficult it is to play on an iPad. Now, I had some light experience with this, but I usually never play the game itself on the iPad. So I want to try to start from the beginning. And if you don't know, this is my third Roblox account. Yes, yes I, have I have three, three of, them. of them. This is the first time my third account ever has entered this game. So we're starting from the beginning, of course. Future Sandy here. This video has been laying in my program for two months. I literally forgot this video even existed. And I remember at the time thinking, I'm not gonna post this video, but here I am. I managed to get sick for the second time this year. In other words, I have to use what I have. So I figured I could finish this. So a reminder that this video is older. In other words, some of the journey quests that currently exist didn't exist back here. But without further ado, back to the video. Let's just get started. So the controls are strange, in my opinion. Now it is iPad, so I gotta think differently. Moving around with the character is pretty simple on um, the iPad, I would say. I always have one rule when I make a new account. The first horse I capture, that's gonna be my main horse. So I don't just wanna grab any horse. I don't know why I am like this, I just am. And I usually go for these horses that I'm riding. I want to do something different this time around. And also this gives me a chance to get familiar with uh, the riding and everything. It's not that difficult, but it's still something that I gotta get used to. It's actually not that hard to move around at the moment, but yeah. Oh, I did not mean to do that, by the way. I misclicked. So let's just grab the glass on and everything. Okay, let's see. Ooh. Okay, tap. Is that working? Oh, three hearts. Anywho, we finished that. Yes, we have two horses to tame before we unlock the ponies, which is awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and go into the stables. Why do I keep, do I keep getting, getting burger, burger as a random, random name? name? I've, I've had, had so many horses, horses getting, getting this. It. I'm gonna heart burger and I'm gonna sell the start horse that I got. Should I keep the name on the other horse? <laughs> no, I'm gonna name it seriously. I'm gonna name it Onyx. I can't really see what I'm typing. Assume I'm writing correctly. Okay, there we go. So I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna bring out Onyx. We need to capture one more horse, so let's go ahead and do that. I feel like doing the journey quest in a speed run. If you don't know, I've tried this up to, what was it, the gargoyles and something or kelpies? I don't remember. Anywho, I tried to speed run at some point in a video and it was interesting. Boom, we're selling that horse. Now I'm at locked horse taming. I'm gonna capture some of these horses. Also need to try and tame horses using food. That's gonna be interesting. Wait, this one is five. Oh, it's because I didn't have any level up skill in the journals. That could be why. So, we need to tame five horses. Harvest, ten forgeable, and jump over ten obstacles. That's easy. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I might go ahead and buy the battle lassos. Usually I would go for the string lassos, but I've started to get lazy and start to use the woven lassos way more. When I played back in the day, it was cheaper to buy certain things. It's more expensive now. So we got some coin and we got a horsey. Thank you very much. That I'm gonna sell right away because I don't want it. So I'm only gonna use Onyx as my main horse, and which is something that I always say when I'm doing these videos. I recommend focusing on one horse only. And... Um, have them do the work. You went all over the place. Also, it's more difficult to gather that now. Usually it's eight to get a apple barrel. In the beginning, it's always difficult. You only have one horse and the horse is kind of weak and it does its own thing. It's jumping and jumping. Let's just have a look and see. I want to try and get the other horses as soon as possible. So 25 food tames and 25 lassos. It's doable. It's not impossible. Are you all right? Can you... Can you actually do your work? Please, Onyx. You gotta earn your keep, my friend. I'm not sure how long I want to try and do this. Until it's not possible for me anymore. <laughs> I guess. I can pretty much do all these up to a certain point. But at some point, it's gonna take too long for me. I just wanna try and see how it's like to be on the iPad. And so far, I've noticed some things that are different. For example, 
when I pressed the stop button multiple times in this uh, session, it just quick stops me automatically. It doesn't slow down, like tap, tap, slow down. It just forcefully slows down, which is strange. Okay, so I have a few apples. I need more, but um, I'm just gonna go ahead and get over to these horses. And I'm gonna have you farm that so you get more XP. And I'm gonna go ahead and we sneak. So feed and tap a tap. You're standing up. Did I press the stand up button by accident? <laughs> Maybe I did. Just tap. I'm tapping you. Why are you not working? This is so stupid. When you're holding an apple, by the way, or anything that's uh, forgeable, you can't press things around you, which is so dumb. I want to get another horse equipped to me. That's one thing that I want to do in this video. Secondly, I want to see how far I can get while I'm doing this. I should really focus on uh, multiple things, but yeah, I just... I'm a little bit scatterbrained, if I'm gonna be honest. I like sprinting. <laughs> I don't know why. Sprinting is so fun on the iPad. Oh, that's so slow. And the finish the quest, awesome, tame five horses, we love. So we need to harvest 10 forgeables, which uh, we are working on. <laughs> it takes some time. And I actually really hate taming horses with food. It's just a necessity, you have to do that at some point, like you can't avoid it if you want your upgraded slot. But what I noticed that things are going slower on the iPad. It is doable. And I don't actually dislike it. I think it's actually really nice. I can actually walk. Which I don't think I can do on the computer. I don't even think they could have a walkie walk. If you're doing this and you press once, you automatically quick stops. Which, if you're on the PC, that doesn't happen, by the way. I have a lock build mode. Yeah, I keep forgetting that that's a feature that exists. My goodness. How, How many, many here remembers, remembers build mode? I was fascinated with it in the beginning. Eventually, I just stopped caring. I don't know why. It just didn't interest me at all when the... I think most people in this game, me, myself included, focus on just grinding for money and breeding for the dream horses that people want. That is what I'm guessing anyway. I could be wrong here, but um, for me personally, I'm just playing this game to get rewards from the contests, like the taming and the cosmetic one. And I just try to breed interesting combinations of horses, mainly gargs, because... Uh, I'm a guard girl. I love gargles, okay? It's just who I am. And for some reason, this camera mode was not available until now. I do like the camera mode. It's still easy to use, even on the iPad, which is surprising to me. If not easier. Will we finish that? Awesome. Now we're just gonna jump over obstacles. There are no horses near me. That's really unfortunate. Usually, I tend to multitask when I'm doing these videos. It's a little easier on the computer, I would say. But uh, I just chose a bad place to do this at the moment, so that's also on me. But for now, let's just go ahead and do some jumpy jumps. And also, before, this is also new, because you can actually miss, which you didn't before. And uh, I don't know why they added that, but it works. Oh, turning was difficult. Okay, that was a miss, but it cleared me. And we're just gonna do this a couple more times. Have to clear them as well, you know? And we finished that. Stop. We unlocked Pony Taming. And Lyric, apparently. I didn't know yet you unlocked NPCs after a while. I'm just gonna keep this pony for now. I'm not a big fan of ponies. Honestly, I don't like the ponies. So we're gonna have the Ikus now. Breed a horse four times. Love and a horse scale four times. And harvest 20 forcibles. Now this is where another horse would be really handy. I need to capture a few horses and keep them. Oh, I hate the quick stopping. Stop that. It's so, so annoying. annoying. I think on the um, keyboard, you press shift and back key. And you have to press that for it to do that. But you automatically quick stop even though you just tap once. Which is good in some ways, but also very negative depending what you're doing. And I'm gonna breed uh, one of you guys with Orchid. That's two horses in the breeding right now. You need to breed a horse four times. So... You don't need to have a fall <laughs> at least 10 times yet. I'm saying yet because that will happen eventually. Oh, that's far away. Stop, please. You're going into the stables. And I hate that as well. It forces you to click on um, another horse when you're taming and something else. And they're like, do you want to cancel this taming? taming? No. I want to pursue the one that I've been chasing this whole time. Thank you. Why are they all males? I need a female. Hello. Hello. <laughs> What's up with that? 
Thank you, a female, finally. That's like, what? Five horses in a row? That was wrong gender. Read that? I only need to do this one more time. Yes, female. Okay, thank you, thank you. I needed that. I needed that so badly. Oh, I have just enough space for this, by the way. Boom. And I'm gonna sell all the males except Onyx. And the pony. <laughs> I don't like the pony. The females do have foals, and I kind of do want them in a way because it's still money. I say it is actually. Another way of making money in this game is literally just to breed horses. Like, I'm not even capping when I'm saying this. It's true. If you just breed horses and when you come back in, I say it's really worth it because even if you don't get a horse that you particularly wanted, you still get money from that horse that you're selling. And it doesn't cost you anything to breed the horses. I mean, your time, I guess, but that's pretty much it. And let's see. I'm just gonna claim this. Thank you. Get some coin. And we're doing the harvest thing. You need to level up a skill four times. His agility is going up as well, which is perfect. Ooh, hold on. It's a winged horse. Miska. Yep. Money. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, we're in a good spot here, so hopefully we can get some things happening. I'm just going to go ahead and feed you. And hopefully you can give me something while you're over there, my friend. Yes, thank you. Oh, it cancelled me when I did that. That's a little unfortunate. It doesn't do that on the computer. On the computer, it lets you walk away and come back without any problem. Almost finished the lassos and taming horses using food is a little obnoxious but it, it needs to be done. Uh, oh, it's too good. Why are you giving me the good ones? Stop that. And he should level up his uh, strength skill soon as well which is awesome. Yeah, look at that. He just leveled up. Sweet. So we got one skill done. And I'm not going to do all the Johnny quests by the way in this video. That would be ridiculous. I am not crazy. Come on, people. I would be here for like 500 hours and then it would be like a live stream instead of me, well, trying to do things. <laughs> I recently have sold my main horses, like the first horses I caught on uh, each of my accounts. Joker and Archie, I sold them. And it's a little strange saying that because they were literally with me for a very long time. And I sent them into the void. <laughs> I have no regrets, but still a little sad. It's actually not that bad playing on the iPad. I actually am quite enjoying it, but is it something that I would do willingly? No, I would go on my PC any day. But I don't dislike the fact that I am currently playing on the iPad, which surprises me quite a bit. Ooh. That horse should have run away from me like a long time ago, but yeah, sure. What? Already 17 with food? When did that happen? I actually didn't pay attention to that. That's really quick. I need to think as well. I think... I didn't level up the jumping skill yet, which is probably a good thing, because I needed that. Yeah, I didn't level it up yet, because I had a feeling, and the fertility, we can also level up, so we can pretty much one-shot that, I think. That's easy. Do I have any brain cells? No, I don't. Wait, where am I going again? again? I forgot what I'm doing in my life. So, let's just bg you him, and did that level him up? It did. Yes. Okay. So, we just need to do some jumping. There's a monster chasing us. Go, 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 go. We got it. Nice, we finished. So now we just need to harvest seven more times and then we're Gucci. Vibin. Five more times with food tames and six more times with lassos. Okay. The best thing you can do in the beginning is probably just farm the apples in town. But yeah, I'm I'm a rebel. I'm doing it my way. Yes, which is a bad idea most of the time. Now this is the um, journal quest for the Ecos. So the biosaurs are next. But I don't remember exactly what happened after a certain point. That was fun. I actually really enjoyed that. But yeah, we will see what happens, but um, I will try and uh, do as much as I can. No, this is not a speed run by any means. I think I did one video when I actually tried to do as much as I could in a certain amount of time. I actually did pretty good in that speed run, but now there are more journal quests active. And um, at the time when I did that video, I think the Kelpies, the Peritons, and the face did not exist during this time. So that's a little different compared to now. Honestly, Peritons journey quest was the most obnoxious thing that I've ever seen. That one required you to be around people so much. You could not solo quest that, by the way. And I'm a solo player when it comes to horse dive. I love playing alone. I don't like boss fights. I don't like anything like that, so. And I'm not saying that I don't like playing with people, I just prefer playing the game alone. 
Which can sound pretty boring for some of you, maybe, perhaps, but it's just who I am. I really don't like that I have to re-interact with this horse. Even though I already am. On the computer, it doesn't really work like that. It's a little different than on the PC. You can't have it all, as they say. I would love to have at least the basics. There we go. So we unlocked the Ecos Taming. Wait, what? The world map unlocked with that? That's interesting. Only 54 for that? That's so sad. What the bush? Yeah, we need to just do this one more time. Wood farming and taming the horses. And then we're good to go. So I finished the food taming, which is awesome. I hate taming with food. It just takes so long, but sometimes... For example, if you're taming gargoyles or unicorns, etc. It really is handy to tame with the food instead of using... Well, on the lasso, because it takes so much money to buy a lasso of any, any kind, really, when you get above the biosaurs, in my opinion. So, yes, we can unlock this. Now, we have a little secondary horse, which is really fancy. Now, the journey quests. Right, what is the one for the biosaurs? Oh, that's a pretty biosaur. You always get different horses, depending on what quest it is, which is always fun. I'm gonna have you two farm that for me while I'm having a look-see. So, biosaurs. Full horse five times. Oh, here's the problem. Yeah, I remember now. Harvest wooden log forge balls and level up any horse strength skill five times. This is not hard to do. I'm, I'm not, not gonna, gonna do, do this, this right now. I might go back in the future and play myself, but yeah. Playing on the iPad is not difficult, but my hands are hurting. <laughs> But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. I really do appreciate it. And it's a little different than not what I normally would do, I guess. I love Horse Life. Horse Life is an amazing Roblox game and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Regardless what platform it is. There are some things that did annoy me on the iPad. And that's one, when you're sprinting on the horse and you tap once on the backwards button, you automatically quick stop, which can be quite tedious. And also, the camera steering is a little difficult as well. You need to do it manually yourself, which makes sense. Taming with a lasso is not that difficult, but food taming was annoying. I'm actually quite surprised how easy it was to play on the iPad. I expected it to be more difficult. My hands did hurt, though, at the end here. And I've been playing for, what, 40 minutes. And um, I have problems with my hand normally, but it's just it was really painful after a while playing on the iPad. So I can see that being a problem, that the pain and everything can kick in. But yeah, what do you guys think? Do you guys play on an iPad, a phone? Do you use a PC? And whatever you play on, maybe you play on both. Which one do you prefer? Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you all there very soon. Bye bye, yo. Now, let's see if I can finish the journey quest on this account as well. Yeah, I might be crazy, but I'm not that crazy. Yeah, I'm just gonna go. Bye. Oof. Well, certainly it's hard to stop sometimes. Well, this is interesting. Bye. <laughs> Schnitzel. <laughs>